Hey guys, I'm going to try something different this evening. One thing I have a real passion for that you guys probably don't know is cooking. I've been down to the market today and I thought I'd just show you this really simple recipe and see if anyone enjoys it. So, really, really simple recipe. 100 grams smoked haddock. Beautiful, straight from the market. Two free range eggs, absolutely stunning. About 150 ml of cream. 25 grams of butter, salt, pepper. Uh, I've gone for about a pint of stock. That was in my freezer. It was already homemade, but you could just use a normal one. About 150 grams of rice. A good serving of white wine. And a leek. Just the bottom bits, just the white bits. One thing about the wine, a lot of people go with cheap wine. Go for a nice wine. Go for a wine you enjoy. Um, I'll show you what I'm going to make with this. Okay, so now we've got all our ingredients and we're sorted. The first thing we need to do is pick up that lovely piece of haddock. Now, personally, I'm going to steam it. The other way to do it is poach it. Boiling water, glass bowl, 10 minutes. Job's good and it'll come out, it'll flake perfectly. Best way if you don't have a steamer, but personally I prefer to steam it. Nice, healthy, really brings out the flavour. Okay, so it's into steam, give that 10 minutes or so. While we do that, we'll get our leek, we'll get the butter, nice warm frying pan, butter in, leeks in 10 15 minutes, let them soften, don't burn them, low heat, and we'll move forward from there. Leaks are sauteing, left a tiny amount of butter, we'll keep that to the end, a bit creamy, a bit nicer. So it'll take about 15 minutes, fish is poaching, time to try that nice wine. Try not drink it all. So, this is nicely poached, flaking lovely. Leeks are pretty much there, so it's time for the next step. So, leeks are pretty much there. Next step is a good step, don't drink it. Put a good dash in there. And just let this reduce. There shouldn't be much left to it when we get round to that. Nice high heat now. Then once we've done that, there's also rice straight in. Coat it nicely. So, one thing I forgot to mention while this is cooking is this is a recipe for two because good food's boring by yourself. But as you wait, it's time to pick up a beer now you've drunk the wine. See what happens. Rice has gone in, really important now, minute or two, really coat it with whatever's left in there, the residue, and just, just leave it, don't rush it. It's a really important part. After that, ladle by ladle. One at a time until it's all absorbed of stock. That's about it now. 15 minutes or so, keep doing that, just repeat, job's good. So that's reduced down nicely now, that's all the stock gone. The rice has stayed nice, nice and firm, nice and creamy. So, last bit of butter in. Put that lovely, lovely fish in, cream, and just fold that in. While I do that, and give it another five minutes, I'm going to poach my eggs. That's it, risotto's ready, done, egg on, bit of fresh parsley, salt and pepper, beautiful. Hope you enjoy.